Hello, I'm Lou and welcome to my channel. In this week's video, we'll check out the contents of April's Scrawler Box. So let's check it out. Okay, let's see what we've got inside. Okay, I can see the theme here. Uh, so we've got a tiger print. Uh, let's see. Uh, so we always get a, a suite in uh, every month of the Scrawler Box. It's normally uh, kind of around the theme in the box. So we've got a caramel, like hard candy suite. Um, we'll get a sharpener, it's a dual uh, sharpener uh, for a Statler graphite, um, and it's quite heavy duty, it's very heavy, so yeah, that's cool. Ooh. And then let's see what we've got in here. Okay, okay, um, we always get a, a sticker, um, which is the scrawler uh, design uh, every month in the box. Um, and it's clearly the same as the print there so that's cool and here we go we've got the scrawler challenge which is walk on the wild side uh, let's take a wander into the wilderness um, delve deep into the jungle kingdom of your imagination creative with textures color depth smart making and building up your line work to explore the wild side of your artwork um, that's actually quite up my street. Um, if you haven't followed me, um, I do do a lot of um, animal um, art. Uh, it's my go-to actually. I love uh, drawing animals, painting animals. So yeah, this is really right up my street. So I'm looking forward to this one. Um, get a rubber, uh, factice. So yeah, just a plain rubber. Um, we also get the uh, uh, Unipin Fine Line uh, Extra Fine Brush uh, Pen. Uh, it's water and fade proof and it's pigment ink. Uh, let's have a look. Oh my gosh, look how tiny that is. That's really cool. You can get some really fine details with that. So just quickly, uh, I will swatch these properly, but wow, that's nice. Yeah, and I love the fact that you can actually, if you can just about see, you can actually, there's a little window in the um, lid, so you can actually see the brush tip, that's cool. And then lastly, we have the Derwent Fine Art Pencils, it's a pack of six. Um, again, um, if you haven't been following me, I have a few videos on Derwent Art Materials. Um, it's actually my favorite uh, brand. Um, so if you want to go check out some of those videos um, there is a playlist um, so yeah check those out um, oh wow I love these colors they're quite earthy uh, so we've got the Derwent Chroma Flow um, uh, coloring pencils and um, it is um, we've got foliage um, white uh, basil, if you can see that, uh, golden sun, uh, black, and we've got raisin, it's like a, a reddy brown, that's really nice. So we'll uh, we'll swatch those out um, in a moment, I'll pop those aside. Okay, let's see what else we've got in here. So we've got the zine, the school zine for April. Um, so um, with these art materials, it's what's been created, which is really quite, quite textured, it's quite nice. Okay, and that, that just gives you, um, the first page always tells you what you've got in the box, which is cool. And then you've got the featured artist, um, like Q&A. Wow, look at that art, that is beautiful. Yeah, that's the kind of... That's, this is the kind of artist I would follow. I mean, I follow a lot of artists, but this is kind of like my my style. Um, advice, tips and tricks. And then um, some featured artists for, um, that did the Schooler Challenge from the last, uh, or February's um, Schooler Challenge. So, which I, I have uh, done a video on, so if you want to go check that one out. 
I'll, I'll leave a link here. And then just a little bit on colour theory and Earth Day. Um, if you don't know, a scrawler box, if you um, purchase a scrawler box, they do plant a tree. So, um, yeah, uh, it is, they're always given back, which is really cool. So, yeah, it's, it's a really good um, company to, to, to get products from. Um, that's the print. That is beautiful. Oh my gosh. That will probably end up on my wall. I love that. It's lovely. Um, so there's a little bit of a description of the artist, but also a little bit more in the zine. Um, so Cecilia in Mexico City. She's only 21 years old. Wow. So yeah, go check her out. Um, amazing. And then we have, um, the, they always provide some, some form of paper, card, um, uh, board, whatever, uh, to use the art materials on. Um, so they've um, included toned drawing paper. There's 10 sheets and it's 115 GSM. That's cool. Don't think I've really worked on toned paper. I've I've used the um, the blue denim uh, uh, toned paper that they uh, included in the graphite box last year, um, but I've not had this colour before. This is it's actually really nice. Yeah. Okay, so I'll do a little swatch and then um, from there uh, we'll create some art. So let's go. Okay, let's swatch these uh, art materials out. Um, so firstly, we're gonna do the Unipin uh, Fine Line brush pen. Uh, it's in black. Um, so yeah, let's give it a go. Oh. some really fine details with this. I love the fact that, that when you push down you can get some thicker lines as well. It's quite controlled actually. If you go quickly you can get like this quite textured. Um, Chroma Flow Derwent pencils. So this one's Basil. Uh, this one is a uh, foliage. And we've got Golden Sun. And then we've got Raisin. Hmm. 
black. white so this would be interesting oh wow look how much that pops on the paper nice okay and then um, this rubber it says uh, on the back here uh, soft reflexible razor, gently lifting pigment and graphite from paper without damaging the paper. So let's let's um, let's do the white. Let's just see if that works. Okay, that's actually quite impressive. It, it doesn't take it off completely. I'm actually worried that I'm going to uh, tear up the paper, to be honest. But it's actually not tearing up the paper. It's actually coming up quite nicely. Um, but yeah, I'm actually quite impressed with that. Um, and then obviously the sharpener. Um, but uh, I don't need to use the, like show you how to use that. Um, but yeah, I'm actually looking forward to this one. I've, I've got I've already got an idea in my head of what I want to do. Um, so we'll just crack on. So I'll leave you to enjoy the time lapse of me creating an art piece using these art materials um, and I will catch you at the end of the video where I will give you a review of the contents of this box. Enjoy! This heart, yeah. I wanna feel your arms around me. I need you more, need you here more than I would like to admit. Let's.
Let's forget about tomorrow. Yeah. Should I hide away forever? Should I close my eyes and never again hold you tight, call you mine, think about you every time? I remember that it's over. Yeah. You never break, you never lie. You're never ever scared of the dark. So why am I the one who cries? I'm so afraid to be left behind. I think about you a lot. It's almost like I can't stop. Can't stop. Yeah, yeah. You never lose an argument. So I've been trying hard to pretend that I'm okay. It's just a phase. And everything is going just great. I think about you a lot. It's almost like I can't stop, can't stop, yeah, yeah. I always knew that this would happen, yeah. You would find a new distraction. I need you more, need you here, more than I would like to admit. Can we let go of tomorrow, yeah. You never break, you never lie. Never ever scared of the dark So why am I the one who cries? I'm so afraid to be left behind I think about you a lot It's almost like I can't stop Can't stop Yeah, yeah You never lose an argument So I've been trying hard to pretend That I'm okay It's just a phase And everything is going just great I think about you a lot it's almost like I can't stop, can't stop, yeah, yeah.
just two Me and you So I finally finished my art piece as you can tell it's an elephant uh, I'm actually really happy with it um, it is one of my favorite animals and I just wanted to take this opportunity with these art uh, materials to actually um, draw an elephant uh, there are things that I could improve on such as the background and there are some kind of mistakes I made with the actual ink pen which I can't erase um, but yeah I'm actually I'm impressed with what I've come up with and uh, yeah I, I like it I really do like this pen um, you can get some really good detail with this um, I created some mark making just like in the shadow areas and as you can see I did some freckles uh, with this pen uh, it didn't dry as quickly as I thought it would um, so I did smudge a little bit but you can't I, you can't really tell um, so yeah I, I really like this um, pen and I will definitely use it again okay so that's it from me this week if you like what you see please do give me a like share and subscribe and uh, please comment down below what animal would you draw using the prompt walk on the wild side but for now we'll see you next week take care bye <laughs>